Hello friends. Today we will discuss various date and time functions in MySQL. So uh, let us begin with the functions that is related to date and time. So the very first that we are going to look at is sysdate. Fine. So this one is going to give me a system date where it will it will display the date in the format y y y y m m d d and then h h m m and s s this is our minute and second fine same way we have another function that is say now so this now function is also going to generate the same result fine apart from that we have another function that is called current date so uh, we are having two notations for current date this one is uh, 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 will display current date current and un underscore date and apart from that we have cur date so this one is also going to display the current date fine then we have another function that is called day function that will give the day of the day of that particular date fine so suppose if I'm going to write uh, like 2020-02-24 fine so this one will give me the day that is called 24 fine so I got the result 24 even I can have the month function also so this one will give me the month Fine. So from date, it will going to extract the month. Fine. Apart from that, we will have year function. So that year function is going to give me the year from the date. Fine. Now suppose if I want the name of the month, month name. Suppose say January, February, March, April in that way. So you have to use the function say month name fine so that month name function month name function is going to give me the name of the month fine so here i got february same way suppose uh, if i want to apply this particular in uh, any any table so suppose i'm having this table and from this i want uh, the month fine so simply i need to write like month name and in bracket I have to provide the attribute name say a date so this one is going to give me the name of the month on which uh, in which the depositor has opened an account fine same way we can have uh, the day name also fine say I'm going to write day name so this one is going to give me Sunday Monday a uh, Tuesday Wednesday in that way depends on the day fine so this way it is going to generate the result okay uh, now there are few more functions that are related to time also so uh, these functions are related to uh, uh, the date but now we will see the functions which are related to time fine now let us see that functions so the very first function is the hour function if you want to extract the hour from the date fine so this one is r and from that suppose from current uh, time i want to fetch the r fine so I'll, i'm going to write now fine so this is 8 fine so this got give me the current hour again suppose if I'm going to write minute so this one is going to give me the minute fine if I'm going if I want second then it will give me second okay uh, now there is one function uh, that is called microsecond this one is going to give me the microsecond too fine okay so now uh, 
I'm going to give some input like 0, 8, colon 25, colon 31, dot 0, 0, 0, 35. Fine. So let us see the result of this. This one will give me microsecond. So the microsecond is 35. Fine. So this way we can use microsecond function. The another function is current timestamp. So this one is going to give me the current timestamp. Fine. Okay. So now this one will give me the current timestamp that is uh, similar to this date also. Okay. Now I want the date in various formats. Then in that particular case, we have one function that is called uh, date underscore format. Fine. So let us see uh, how that date format function works. Fine. So I need to provide the date over here. So that will be like, uh, suppose I'm going to provide 08 colon 56, 56 and then uh, uh, 23. So this one is the time and I, I'm going to provide 2020, uh, then 05, then 20. Okay. So this I'm going to provide. Now I want this particular in a specific format. So, suppose if I'm going to consider a specific format, then like uh, suppose I want date as first or fifth kind of, fine. Then I want uh, the name of the month and I want the full year, fine. Then I, uh, I want uh, the data uh, like... Uh, Suppose if I want to print the time in such a way like uh, say D, uh, HHMM and uh, SS, 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 SS format, fine. So if I want uh, the time in a specific format, then I, then I, I can also write like percentage T, fine. So this one is going to give me the date in a specific format. Fine, 20th May 2020, 8.56.23. Now there are a number of various options in case of uh, this date format functions. That options, options are already written in, uh, in the description. You can go through that. So we will uh, study a few more date and time related functions uh, in next video thank you very much for watching the video and please don't forget to subscribe the channel